This is how you upload files in Hostinger. Hi everyone, in today's video, I am going to show you how you can upload files in Hostinger. It is very quick and easy. Let's get started. The first thing you want to do is go onto Hostinger and make sure you're logged in. Once you're logged in, you can go ahead and click on websites. Now go to the website where you want to upload your files to. And once you're there, you will click on dashboard. Now, once you're there, you want to scroll down to your left where you see files and click on that. If you're using something other than Hostinger, you can go on to the cPanel where you will be able to find the file manager. Hostinger calls its cPanel hPanel as you can see right here, but it's basically the same thing. So once you're in files, go ahead and click on file manager and now choose whether you want to access the file of that specific website that you chose or access all the files of your plan. I want to upload files onto that specific website. So I will click on the first one. Now Hostinger is great and makes it very easy for beginners so that they don't make any mistakes. As you can see here, it tells you do not upload here. And instead we will upload in the public HTML. So click on public HTML. Now you'll see all the files for your website. For example, you'll see the WordPress config.php as well as the mail, login settings, etc. To upload your files, you can go to the very top, click on that and select an option to upload. So you can either upload from a file or a folder. You can also click on new folder folder to the left or new file if you want to do it that way. What's very important is that you back up your website before you upload any files so that it doesn't mess up your website. If you're using WordPress and you want to back up your website before you upload your file, you can go ahead and install a plugin. And in order to install a backup plugin, you can go ahead and go to your WordPress dashboard, click on add new plugin and search backup. Now you can upload any of these backup plugins to make sure that you are are safe and you are not putting your website at risk just in case anything happens. Now you can choose between any of these backup plugins and make sure you back up your website before you upload any file. And there you have it. That's how easy it is to upload a file on Hostinger. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you found this tutorial very helpful. If you need help with your own website, we have provided a link down below where we can help build your website for free. If you want to get started with Hostinger, we have also provided a link down below to give you a great discount. If you click on any of these links, it will greatly help help support our channel so we can continue making more free videos. Thank you so much and I will see you in the next video.